Hello folks, it's Sunday 14th of November 2010 and I thought I'd take a wee walk out by Wallace as well just to see what's been going on with regard to recent developments from Rob Royson down towards the well. I read recently in a paper somewhere that some council spokesman said that they were fed up with cars knocking holes in the wall down by the well that they weren't going to bother repairing it anymore. Anyway, here I am and it does look as if the place has been tidied up considerably over the years certainly since the days of the 50s when we used to go cycling down here. I just caught a glimpse there, yeah, there's the hole in the wall. Different type of hole in the wall to what we understand by the term nowadays. Maybe Wallace was the first would have been the first person to have such a thing. Looking at the well itself, uh, I don't remember that plinth with the inscription on it from our time. It looks fairly new. Certainly looks a lot cleaner than it did back in the days when we came down here. Oh, I still wouldn't fancy having a drink of it. Paving and stuff round here, railings and so on. Looks as if it's quite tidy nowadays. Another chunk of wall missing there, but I'm not going to dwell on that. When I've finished with this wee bit of filming, I'll take a run up the road towards Rob Royston to the monument and just see how far down the housing development has spread. Because a couple of years ago when I went there, the monument was almost in somebody's garden. And I know there's some interest on the various sites uh, in Wallace's heritage in this area, but it seems to have escaped the Glasgow City Council's attention because nowhere in the area is there a sign to tell a visitor that it is a historic site and that it does belong in Scotland's heritage. There we are, there's a monument and you can see the proximity of those houses Oh yeah, they've built quite a lot more because this used to be quite a densely wooded little area years ago. I suppose looking at that, the rate they're going at, by the time I visit here again, Wallace as well could be a feature in somebody's garden too. Well, hope you enjoyed this wee sojourn.